donkey. Yes. You are a donkey. I'll show you how to act a donkey. Everything that Charlemagne is saying is true. Yeah, it's Donkey of the Day for Friday, November 1st, goes to the Nugget Casino uh, Resort in Reno, Nevada, in particular the security there. Here's one thing I would never understand about security. It's the same thing I don't understand about law enforcement. I know you have a job to do and I respect it, but why you gotta be so extra about your job? In the words of the Joker, why so serious? Why? See, there was a woman named Heather Venus who was a regular at the Nugget Casino in Reno for the last three years. Heather and her medical dog, Cherry, would visit the casino at least four to five times a week. Uh, she has a medical dog who is trained to alert Heather if she is about to have a seizure. Let me tell you how Heather describes the Nugget Casino. She said, they know who we are. When we come in, they automatically bring me water for my dog. The dog gets free drinks at the Nugget Casino. But Atlanta News first said what is typically a home away from home atmosphere was quickly changed a couple of weeks ago when a security guard approached her and told her she had to leave. Would you like to know why she had to go? Let's go to Atlanta News first for the report, please. Heather Vanis says she's been a regular at the Nugget Casino in Reno for the last three years. Sometimes, Vanis says she visits her friends four to five times a week at the casino. Accompanying Vanis on her trips is her medical dog, Cherry, who is trained to alert Vanis if she's about to have a seizure. What is typically a Cheers-like atmosphere for Vanis quickly changed two weeks ago when a security guard approached her and told her to leave because Cherry was not present. On that day, Vanis says Cherry had had just gotten fixed. Since her fiance was with her at the casino, she felt like she was safe to leave Cherry home if she had a medical episode. Vanis considered the nugget her safe place and adds that not being able to see her friends there has been heartbreaking. Now, all she wants is an apology and for the nugget to educate their staff on how to handle others with medical dogs. The nugget issued a statement that says in part, service animals are always welcome at our property and our team is trained to ensure that all guests are treated with respect and in accordance with federal and state law. Poor Heather. She had no idea she was the plus one. Uh, you didn't get the hint when they were bringing your dog free drinks, but not you. They used to bring the dog water, okay, all the time. We live in a world where security trusts you with your dog over over your fiance. I understand humans are not, you know, reliable in 2024. I get it, but Nugget Casino cut it out. This is what I mean when I say security takes their job too serious. You told this woman that if the dog stayed at home, she should have stayed at home with the dog. Let me ask you a question, security. Once the service dog, uh, you know, Cherry does his job and alerts Heather, she's about to have a seizure. You do know once the dog does that, then humans and God have to take over. The dog can't do anything for her after he alerts her. So her having her fiance there is actually better, okay? Heather says she didn't take Cherry that day because she had just gotten Cherry fixed and she felt like it was safe to leave her service dog at home since she was with her fiance in case she had a medical emergency. I agree, okay? A service animal is essential to some folks, but just because someone has a service dog doesn't mean they need the animal every second of the day, especially if they have a perfectly good human with them. Remember us, okay? Okay? I know, you know, in the world of service animals and AI, we can get lost, but human lives matter, all right? Kicking this woman Heather out is like saying, we don't trust you to be here without your service dog, nor do we trust that you can take care of yourself. Your dog knows better than you do. This really feels like y'all got y'all sensitivity training from an episode of The Office. Okay, you got people in that casino gambling away their life savings. You got people in that casino drinking themselves to death, but you tell a woman without her service dog, she gotta go? That's where you draw the line? Even though she's there with her fiance? Y'all heard the uh, the statement that the Nugget Casino released, right? Where they said they are fully committed, fully committed to complying with all ADA requirements and they welcome all guests with disabilities who use service animals. Service animals are always welcome at our property and our team is trained to ensure that all guests are treated with respect and in accordance with federal and state laws. While we can't comment on specific incidents, we remain dedicated to offering an exclusive environment for all our guests. Heather, it just boils down to this. The Nugget Casino likes your dog more than you, okay? <laughs> Cherry is the invited guest, okay? And you are the plus one. In fact, they think you are Cherry's service human. That's the only explanation, okay? They don't care about you or your disability. They care about the dog. And the irony of this story, at least to me, is the older I get and the more I get to know people and hear stories like this, the more I realize why Noah only allowed animals on the ark. Please give the Nugget Casino Resort the biggest hee-haw. Uh -huh. Uh -huh.
That's so backwards. Cold world. Normally, people have issues with the service animal, not the people. Like cold they. world. Donkey today is sponsored by renowned personal injury attorney Michael the Bull Lamisoff. Don't be a donkey when you need a fighter on your side. If you're ever injured, go to michaelthebull.com. That's michaelthebull.com. And when you mess with the bull, you get the horns. Wake that ass up. Uh, in the morning. The Breakfast Club.